working, playing, living. Seeing is believing. But for thousands of people every year, the sense of vision is lost, forcing them to relearn the smallest details of living. For over 50 years now, one organization has been teaching people to live without sight. Lions World Services for the Blind is a comprehensive rehabilitation center that trains adults who are blind or visually impaired. The center was founded over a half a century ago in Little Rock, Arkansas by Roy Cumpy, who originally approached the Lions Club for funding and their support and donations continue. But because of the growing need for our services, the center looks to individuals and organizations for financial support. Today, World Services for the Blind offers a wide variety of vocational courses, as well as a career training center, assistive technology classes, psychological counseling, and personal adjustment training. The on-campus cafeteria, along with the men's and women's dormitories, can accommodate nearly a hundred residents. World Services for the Blind is a growing and dynamic rehabilitation center that offers individualized training to visually impaired adults who need everything from basic living skills to advanced job placements. Applicants in the United States are usually referred to the center by each state then they enter a 30-day evaluation process to determine the individual's own special needs. Based on the results of this evaluation, the professional staff and the individual then determine the amount and kind of personal adjustment training or vocational training each applicant will need. The center's personal adjustment training reflects the daily living needs of a person who is blind. Among these adjustments are learning skills like braille and typing, cooking and cleaning, or traveling with the use of a long cane. Other adjustments are either psychological or emotional. The center's other services also include a staff psychiatrist and a psychological examiner. Personal adjustment training also includes counseling in social interactions and developing self-confidence. Activities both on and off campus are also scheduled to provide opportunities to interrelate and enhance self-esteem. All of these skills focus on the importance of the trainee learning to live independently. If more technical training is needed, the center's assistive technology classes teach the use of state-of-the-art computer hardware and software to communicate and be productive both at home and in the workplace. By enlarging the print on the screen and utilizing voice and braille output devices, trainees learn to become more competitive. Trainees also utilize these technologies in the various vocational courses that are offered. These courses prepare individuals for careers in both white and blue collar jobs. Some are job specific and are approaching a 100% placement, like the three Internal Revenue Service courses that are offered. Other vocational programs include medical transcription, horticulture, small business management, Bicycle Assembly and Repair. Clerical Skills. Small Engine Repair. And Telecommunications Specialist. Also, extensive computer training is offered and teaches the very latest in programming and information technologies. After vocational training, trainees can enhance their job-seeking skills in the Career Training Center, which offers both classroom and one-on-one -on -one instruction. The instruction covers practical applications like resumes, grooming, mock interviews, and job shadowing. 